one and only Adonis Creed. You're the best pound for pound fighter in the world. Three years ago, it's been a minute since you've been out in these streets. When I walked away from boxing, I walked away with some unfinished business. You see that man right there? Do you remember him? What's special about this moment, it's two black men starring in this blockbuster film. Last time we had that was, what, 2018, 2017, Black Panther. It's been a minute. Have you guys had a chance to reflect on that impact, these two black men leading this major motion picture? From, from my perspective, uh, I had the vision that you spoke of, the fact that there would be two black men leading, you know, the largest sports franchise in the history of cinema. Mm. Um, that, that was a big calling card for me, you know, to, to get that uh, to the culture and to participate in that. In the course of two hours, we went from not, not, not being friends and, 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 and partners on this film to, to that, you know what I mean, in two hours. How long have you known each other? It was like brothers. We definitely thought about and talked about and wanted to pour everything we had into it to make sure we were doing it the right way and do it justice. Yeah. So so that was something that we definitely wanted to do. And a heck of a directorial debut for you, man. I mean, you. I'm an anime fan myself, so okay. seeing the way you filmed this, <laughs> I saw the Akira influence, yeah. I saw some DBZ in there. Speak a little bit about how much that influenced the style <laughs> and what you were trying to go for. Being the ninth film out of, you know, the Rocky Creek franchises and, you know, and a plethora of other boxing films, you know, wanting to, you know, I had to be a little bit more creative and think outside the box of how to make these fights feel different. Mm -hmm. um, and my love for anime definitely, you know, I watch it every day. It was naturally in my thought process of how to like kind of blend, you know, anime and live action in a way that it really works, you know, not, you know, because we've seen a lot of versions of it that doesn't work. Mm -hmm. So for me, I think boxing was the perfect medium to talk about, you know, to, to explore the idea behind you know, the internal dialogue, you know, the telegraphing. So I found moments, places to really make it organic and impactful um, and, and made the, the fights feel different, especially shooting in IMAX also. So that really helped out a lot. Uh, you played the scariest dude named Diamond I've ever seen in my life. Uh, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Diamond, what <laughs> went into forming that, I hate to call him a villain, but the antagonist for you? Great collaboration. You know, the script and the director can tell you which part of society to look at. And in this case, I got to look at my own home my own upbringing, you know, uh, my stepdad um, was incarcerated for 15 years before he, you know, before we came upon each other and he raised me up, you know, I understood what that uh, dream deferred was, you know, all he wanted to do was be a mechanic, you know, that's all he wanted, have, have his own garage, um, all Dane wants to do is be a champ, that's it, and now he's trying to get that, he's trying to gain that, um, I saw how he was, I saw, I saw how the system, and in the system, um, kind of held him down. There may have been a time when Damien had your back. No friends in the industry. But that's not what he's doing now. And a good deal of Dane is a love letter to, to him and, and to men like that, you know, who maybe it's not incarceration, but it's something that has stalled you out, you know, that has postponed your uh, potential greatness. Um, that hopeful dream is something that allows him to not be villainized, you know. When you have such a pure and honest hero, you have to match that complexity with the, with the villain. You know? All right, Kang and Killmonger, two greats right here. Thanks a lot, guys, for uh, doing this and for a great film. <laughs>